good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning. I hope everybody's doing good. No time stamp, okay? Just gonna flow. Got the five of wands, okay. Five of wands, the wheel, the eight of cups, the eight of wands. So I don't know what you guys are fighting about, okay? I think you're fighting about something that's just... Relentless. Petty. I feel like there was a huge misunderstanding. And somebody walked away from a new start. And I, I think it was ego driven. Like. This is fighting over people that probably are not even even in the picture anymore. Ex-boyfriends, ex-girlfriends, scrabbling over this family dynamics here too. Um, some of you are arguing over how somebody passed away and why they passed away for some. Um, someone keeps using the expression, you hung me out to dry. This was like an explosive argument at one point. It's, it's not as explosive as it was, but there could have been a new start. I think there's a chance that you could still have a new start with somebody if you walk away from the bullshit. I feel like that king of wands wants to stay um someone definitely thinks they're more superior than you are privileged it's a given i think somebody as a child got more attention than the other person someone kind of definitely felt like a misfit like they were out to prove something to somebody if you guys are twins, it was the bigger twin that got the, like, the smarts in the family. Or so they think they got the smarts of the family type thing. But, <laughs> 
lo and behold, this little, the, the smaller twin holds the most power. For those in that scenario. But it's one of those things where, like, spirits, like, get over it. Like, like, it's like apples to oranges. Get over it. Okay? Ridiculous. This is like family feuds. This, If you're dealing with the King of Wands, okay, their ego is just triumphant. It, it, I don't even know what to say. But it's like, they're dealing with family shit. Um, what about this? Oh, this is the Eight of Wands. I thought it was the Ace. So this is communication. And, and two eights again in, in a row. This is also money related. I don't see the money right now at all. But whomever walked away from a situation, you're going to get a message from this person. I think it's going to be ego driven. I, I don't, I still don't think it's going to be like a, a yay conversation. Like it's just conflict. It's just the way it's supposed to be though. The, the, because the door never closed. Whomever this is for, okay? The door never closed. And someone's hoping it's going to be, you know, a good scenario. Um, yeah, see? Someone's hoping it's going to be a good scenario with this Ace of Pent. So... about the six of wands this six of wands is the king of wands okay um that was at the bottom of the deck i felt like it stuck but it was the it was the princess of cups with the three of wands the eight of swords and the nine of pentacles. so this is this six of wands can be victory it's so funny because it wants to come out as victory every time but i just i'm not reading this as victory or necessarily ego. I can't place this card yet. So I guess I'm going to stick with the victory because, you know, it keeps coming out like that. And if you're not victorious yet, you will be. Just stand your ground, you know, but the whatever you're doing, don't slack. So if you think like everything's like happy-go-lucky and the, there's no, there's no way something wouldn't work out or there's no way it could go this way, don't let your ego get in the way of that bullshit, okay? Because this has to do with your future. Whatever this future endeavor is over here, it's not done growing. So don't don't be cocky. And my hand's shaky, okay? Look at that. That's not me, all right? So there's, wow, okay? So there's, there's some, ner this person's nervous as F. And it definitely has to do with your future. They're all up there. That to me right right now is is straight up nerves. That's it. When it has to do with the future. How do we do this? How do I do this? That they're trapped. You know, like I, what's up, Buttercup? I'm hungry. Your son's hungry. Go on. Yeah. All right, I'll be on in a few minutes. This is pure fear. Okay, like they're all up in their head. They don't they don't know how to climb out of it. This is all fear about coming back to the past, bringing something up that has to do with the past. How do I text this one particular person? How do I text the past? How do I do it? Because even here, but they know, but the, the wheel is here. So they're going to. It's also the comma that needs to be confronted. So if somebody wants to reach out, this is past arguments, petty, petty shit. Let it go. You want, somebody wants it, that new stop all day. Somebody's feeling like wild right now too. Wild, 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 wild. Okay. 
So whomever that's for, I kind of feel like it's just kind of what we've been reading, but it, it's still coming in. I, I wouldn't say cut nobody any slack. I, I wouldn't be a bitch or an ass, but like, I don't know. I, I feel like it's totally okay for me to, to say that when I say don't don't cut no one no slack because it's not necessary. All right? Because you're the queen of cups. You're the chariot. All right? Something's going to move forward. But, like, that does not want to stay in my hands. Okay? So maybe it's, it's stationed right now. But, like, I always say, like, have compassion and all that. But, like, to me, like, this is saying, like, It'd be a feisty biatch, too. Look where that lightning bolt sits. Holy shit with that lightning. Don't take advantage of the situation. But I definitely wouldn't cut no slack. You know, this, this Queen of Cups, pretty, pretty confident. No joke. So I don't know if it's saying ultimately it's up to you whether or not you want to move forward with this because it's going in your direction. You know, but like, that's the message, believe it or not. Like, don't cut no slack. It's not, I mean, obviously, you know, you can forgive. There's always room, room for forgiveness, even for your, yourself, your own well-being. All right, but like, This is being guided, so tell me about this queen. The three of cups with the strength, all right? This is what I'm saying too, like don't cut no slack. You're feisty. You need to be feisty, be feisty. But the Three of Cups, uh, lately, it's just a straight-up celebration. All right? But this is... Apparently, this Queen of Cups needs strength to deal with whatever scenario. But she's more than capable. I, they're basically saying, you have the strength to endure whatever this is. There's no question. Okay? But I don't think... I, I Shit. Don't cut no one no slack. All right? Just... Take that how you want to take it, but it doesn't mean be a bitch or be a prick, okay? It just means however it is you want to decipher that, and that's it. I love you guys. Bye.